clerk and bearer there were yet two days for the congress session to begin i had made up my mind to offer my services to the congress office in order to gain some experience so as soon as i had finished the daily ablutions on arrival at calcutta i proceeded to the congress office babu bhupendranath basu and shri ghoshal were the secretaries i went to bhupendra babu and offered my services he looked at me and said i have no work but possibly ghoshal babu might have something to give you please go to him so i went to him he scanned me and said with a smile i can give you only clerical work will you do it certainly said i i am here to do anything that is not beyond my capacity that is the right spirit young man he said addressing the volunteers who surrounded me he added do you hear what this young man says then turning to me proceeded well then here is a heap of letters for disposal take that chair and begin as you see hundreds of people come to see me what am i to do am i to meet them or am i to answer these busy bodies inundating me with letters i have no clerks to whom i can entrust this work most of these letters have nothing in them but you will please look them through acknowledge those that are worth it and refer me to those that need a considered reply i was delighted at the confidence reposed in me shri ghoshal did not know me when he gave me the work only later did he inquire about my credentials i found my work very easy the disposal of that heap of correspondence i had done it with done with it in no time and shri ghoshal was very glad he was talkative he would talk away for hours together when he learned something from me about my history he felt rather sorry to have given me clerical work but i reassured him please don't worry what am i before you you have grown grey in the service of the congress and are as an elder to me i am but an inexperienced youth you have put me under a debt of obligation by entrusting me with this work for i want to do congress work and you have given me the rare opportunity of understanding the details to tell you the truth said shri ghoshal that is the proper spirit but young men of today do not realize it of course i have known the congress since its birth in fact i may claim a certain share with mr hume in bringing the congress into being and thus we became good friends he insisted on my having lunch with him shri goshal used to get his shirt buttoned by his bearer i volunteered to do the bearer's duty and i loved to do it as my regard for elders was always great when he came to know this he did not mind my doing little acts of personal service for him in fact he was delighted asking me to button his shirt he would say you see now the congress secretary has no time even to button his shirt <laughs> he has always some work to do shri goshal's naivete amused me but did not create any dislike in me for service of that nature the benefit i received from this service is incalculable in a few days i came to know the working of the congress i met most of the leaders i observed the movements of stalwarts like gokhale and surendranath i also noticed the huge waste of time there i observed too with sorrow even then the prominent place that the english language occupied in our affairs there was a little regard for economy of energy more than one did the work of one and many an important thing was no one's business at all critical as my mind was in observing these things there was enough charity in me and so i always thought that it might after all be impossible to do better in the circumstances and that saved me from undervaluing any work